Okay, so I decided that I just can't wait. I am super impatient. So I'm going to be doing an early results um, pregnancy test and I'm actually going to be using Clear Blue. This is the one left over from last month. So um, this is going to be my first live test at 11 DPO and like I said in my last update, I'm going to continue to do live testing for the rest of the week. Even if this one comes up negative, because there is a huge possibility that this one could still be negative. Um, so I'm not trying to get my hopes up too much. Um, thinking positive and hoping for the best. So here it is. I'm not going to show you the cup, but I'm just going to talk through it. So this is the test. And... Uh, that's blurry, but, um, <clears throat> I think I have to dip it for five seconds. So, one, two, three, four, and five. So, um, not sure. I think three to five minutes I have to wait. I'm actually going to turn it over and not look because... It's just going you know, to freak me out just sitting here staring at it. So, right now it's just testing. Um, I don't know what else you would say. And I have to wait three minutes. So, I'm on my phone right now. I can't really tell when three minutes will be up. So, I'll check back in three minutes. Okay. My heart is just racing. It's been three minutes and um, <clears throat> it's all done. And okay, let's take a look. Uh, just as I thought, it is negative. Not sure if you can see that. Let's just put it down. So, even with an early results test, it came out negative, so a <sighs> little bit bummed about that, but like I said, um, I was sort of expecting it, so I don't know, that puts that whole first positive test into perspective that it could just be something that my mind made up that I was hoping for. So, um, I'm not gonna stop trying now. Um, I'm gonna just keep testing and hope for the best.